Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is General Dreams. I'm Mike. Today, we're going to talk about upper soft doors. You got these kind here. And then, you've got these kind here. So, Kimimoto sent me a set of these to review. As you can tell, I already have the Polaris uppers on this it was part of the package when i bought the machine but we're going to talk about the advantage to each one of them um so there's many advantages each way so you've got these here they seem like they're a pretty good quality and the window material seems like it is probably as thick as these and they attach with velcro straps that go around the bars velcro double stick comes down around there and across here so i could take you this other side where i removed the uppers so you could see you're filling in this whole area so they'll come up this bar and wrap around this and up here down around this and then they go across right about like this kind of a straight line they've got little reflector strips in them these here oh you might have caught that they work pretty good i kind of like that a little extra safety um and then to get in and out of the machine because these are attached to the door you would unzip the velcro there unzip this zipper up to there and then when the door opens that'll open with it and then you close it and then you can just close that zipper back up and you're all sealed back up or you can zip that all the way down and you have these straps here so you can roll that window up and have it rolled down same thing with that one this one is fixed it is the exact same way on these you can unzip this door roll it down to here this one you can unzip roll down to here this one's fixed and you may notice the, the window area back here and here is much bigger on these. The front one, yeah, it might be just a hair because this comes down all the way to the plastic of the door. It comes all the way down to here. So you do have a little bit more. <clears throat> so I would say... With these Kimimoto ones, you're going to have a little bit greater visibility because there's more clear glass, clear plastic area. So, like I mentioned, there's good to both of these. At the time of filming, these Kimimoto ones on Amazon are $359. And... These on Amazon or from a Polaris site online are $1,720. So it really depends on how often you need to have these. Turn this around and look at me again. Hello. So I know that there's lots of people out there like the new expeditions out there and they've got all those different setups for it was well, kind of the same thing i'd say it started with the general but anyway if you have the factory windows they got the lock and ride windows where you just turn a little knob and you can pop that window out same thing with these back ones so there's people like say you live in the desert that kind of climate when the sun's out like this and you're in the desert it could be 120 degrees or it could be 13 degrees. So just because the sun's out, don't mean it's warm. <laughs> and if you're out in those kind of hot environments, during the summertime of year, you probably don't want any of this stuff. You don't want back windows, you don't want front windows, you don't want doors, nothing. So if you're only using these things for hunting season or when it snows, for a couple of months because in reality 
most people aren't going to use these machines that much when it's really cold out unless they're going hunting so do you want to spend 360 or do you want to spend 1720 and there are advantages to each one of them and i will point some of them out like i said this one here it was part of the package when i bought the machine or i would probably have something like that because i don't have 1700 dollars laying around so these here i'll go to the other side where i've removed them just to give you an idea to install these it's got these holes in all these doors and inside those doors you have to take this door apart you have to remove this and you have to install a bracket inside these at every one of these locations line it up perfectly and then drill holes they have some little template things um, but you have to drill all the holes put those on these you just take and I'll stay on this side I think the lighting's better over here so on these ones you just take them and you got the velcro strip and strap that goes around this so it goes up on the here goes around the bar up here goes around the bar here it has a couple straps on this goes around here and then there's the velcro strips that go across here so when it's on you got a nice clean line like right now with the players ones you know it, it does this and then goes back down and comes this. the kimimoto ones the bottom is a straight line so they look real clean there's nothing wrong with that at all um and it's just a pretty major difference in cost these are removable but like i say 1700 versus 300 um if you are a person or you're in an environment where you're gonna have these uppers on all the time and you could afford it i would say this is the one for you if you only are gonna have uppers on there on occasion then this is the one because why would you spend that much money if you're only going to use them on an occasion so that's kind of my take like i say i don't think there's a winner it's just two completely different circumstances um some people are gonna be hardcore no you go with those others are gonna say no you go with those they both have their own situation anyway i think i covered all that stuff if i miss something feel free to comment i'll let you know anything i can um i am an amazon affiliate both of these will be in the link down below you can buy you can buy these from polaris or from amazon you can buy these from Kim, kimimoto or from amazon so there will be an amazon link below which will help the channel i'd really appreciate it and uh like I say, if you have any questions, feel free to comment, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks. I, help, I hope this was helpful for someone out there, and we'll see you on the next one. Have a good one.